Uh, my name is Anjali Merodra. I'm a resident of Mount Side. Um, and my daughters who are here with me today actually went to Governor Livingston High School. So I feel like I'm part of this community. Um, I'm here today representing the Union County Advisory Board on the status of minorities. We are a board led by Commissioner Angela Gerritsen uh, of community members throughout the county, which is one of the most diverse in New Jersey. And we basically are an advisory board, so we don't actually have any executive power or anything, but we basically bring the concerns of the minorities in this county to the commissioners. Uh, we look for uh, concerns, issues, and then propose solutions. Um, when the incidents happened in Atlanta last week, uh, we actually released a statement, and I'm going to read the statement out first. So this is our statement in solidarity with the Asian community. We stand in heartfelt solidarity with our Asian American friends and neighbors during these tense and troubling times. We grieve with the Asian American community and the families of the victims of the horrific shootings in Atlanta that took eight lives, six of whom were women of Asian descent. Racism targeting Chinese and other Asian communities is not new in the United States. Sadly, our country has a history of these sentiments. We condemn the rise in xenophobia amid misplaced blame regarding COVID-19 and the coronavirus that has led to hysteria and scapegoating. Union County is a diverse, caring community, and the Union County Advisory Board on the Status of Minorities pledges to help ensure that all Asian Americans feel safe and supported and to speak up against all forms of hate, attacks, and stereotyping. We pledge to listen to the concerns of the Asian community and to find solutions to allay their fears. We call upon all our elected officials, community leaders, and residents to join in on our commitment to ensure that humanity triumphs over hate in our communities in Union County. Before I go, um, I do want to commend um, Katie for her wonderful words. Um, in my other role, I'm president of the National Organization of, uh, for Women of New Jersey, and I would not uh, I would be amiss if I left here without pointing out what she said in the beginning. In this whole conversation about the incidents in Atlanta and trying to put labels on whether this was racism, hate, or misogyny, we should not forget that there is an intersection here. It can be both. It can be all of those. And so I remind you that many of us in these communities stand at the intersection of many different identities that can make us a target of hate. Thank you.